what's up guys it's max how you guys doing and on stream we were streaming today very nice to be back streaming mcoc um but news came out about this missing champion in my roster so if you look what you're looking at is my six star collection of champions uh i am sitting at a couple of missing champions of course guillotine being one of the apparently reworked champions that she got voted on um which i kind of would want to get my hands on ebony maw i completely missed out on the arenas from uh, being able to grab them as a as one of the champions that i still miss as a six star so those are two i'm um, sorry one and purgatory which was just in the arena so um I haven't been able to grind for six star champions uh, in, because of time constraints, basically. So um, the fact that I haven't been able to, you know, eventually we will get to it. But this video is about collecting another six star champion. So we're going to get another six star champion. The champion we're going to be getting is Unstoppable Colossus right here, guys. So he's been added as a little border shadow in our collection of champions which means there's an option eventually for him to come around and get him i think right and this is what so far it's mean which i'm very excited for dr voodoo so um oh, as we're seeing this it. and we're talking about an uncollected uh, unstoppable colossus i'm seeing dr voodoo and i'm seeing him as a six star uh, i bet very soon we'll see like a basic arena for him and uh Hopefully it falls within a category that I have plenty of time to grind for the champion or we'll see crystals for him. Um, uh, I would rather grind for him than just do crystals, but uh, enough talk about these other champions. Oh, last one to talk about uh, Scarlet, the new Scarlet Witch, which got added on the Sigil store. Uh, I myself, or is, um, I'm going to be going for this champion. I'm going to go for the six star version first followed with the five star version and then obviously we already have the four star um i don't know about the three stars but um yeah that's kind of my game plan six star first five star and so on so let's get to this unstoppable colossus uh as a very unique champion to get so we're gonna go to the store this is where he's currently at at the moment we're gonna be heading over to the loyalty section of our store. If we scroll down, I remember back ooh, many years ago where I was able to get this guy as a four star and that was the hype, the most like toughest, longest holding time that I ever did to get him as a four star. And then the five star was out and then I was like 800 loyalty. Like, are they insane? And that's never gonna happen. And Fast forward a couple of years, we're in 2021, and the six star version of this guy is out. Is he useful? Is he good at anything? Besides sitting inside of a, uh, my collection of champions, probably, you know, nope. But uh, if he does become useful, if he does become reworked, or if he does something, you know, is being useful for him, I'm glad, I'm happy to have him part of my roster. So it's 1.6 million loyalty, which is quite a good amount of loyalty, especially for the guys and girls that are in an AW, um, you know, using uh, a lot of boost, using a lot of glory, uh, loyalty, keep calling it glory, loyalty for these items. So um, as you guys know, I haven't been doing Alliance War for, for over, what, two years now. It's time goes by quick. Um, I haven't been competitive. I still pick these up. As you can see, I pick these up, you know, because I still don't try to try not to die. But my loyalty uh, when it comes to the game sits at over three million loyalty. So I've gathered quite a good amount of loyalty and uh, it's not being used. I was actually considering of not using it and waiting, giving myself a little bit more time to be able to like see what else Kabam brings out when it comes to loyalty use, but 1.6 million, it's not that I can get this overnight. It's going to take a lot of time to get that 1.6 million loyalty back. Um, and I know there's quite a few people out there that just don't have it. And, but it's a nice goal to set in game to say, Hey, I want to be able to get that six star Colossus. So let's go and grab them guys. Let's get, let's spend. We have, as you can see, just over 3 million. We're going to be spending three, 1.6 and there we go and can i get him again to do the awakening unfortunately not we can't so we're not going to be doing the awakening on this video and i wouldn't spend another point 1.6 uh but yeah the uh, the collection of champions has gone a little bit better when it comes to my six stars that adds them right there they're at the bottom 
just next to that juggernaut but i'm excited guys i'm excited to get him added there i'm excited for dr voodoo there's a quite a good amount of new champions that i still don't have six star versions um that are still missing you know from my account but one more champion added very happy to have him there let's take a look at him just a little bit closer um does he have it possibly any other synergies that the five star doesn't have i, I don't think so um but let's just verify just in case um nope um it would be nice if he got if he if he were to get a little bit of a buff um but all attacks nope still a very simple description <laughs> as opposed to what's out there now in game when you when a champion gets released it's like a it's it's a couple of paragraphs on figuring out how to how to work the champion and use the champion and where we would think he would be useful but um yeah that does it for this video guys i went ahead and spent just all that loyalty right now i know it's killing a lot of people saying like i would have used all that for war or um it's not worth it but for me in the collection purposes of this game i like it um you know anytime there's a chance especially uh for free to get a six star or a champion out of it i would go for it but hopefully you have enough of those loyalties in your game so you can go and pick them up uh wish you luck guys and hopefully we can be six star buddies with unstoppable colossus let me know in the comments if you picked it up or if you're gonna wait or if you're setting yourself a goal to get this champion added to your roster um very cool like it uh he's gonna help in arena so i'm happy with that as as you guys know i'm an arena grinders um and haven't been of lately but yeah once we get jumped back into it we, we, ha we have that champion added to our roster guys thank you so much for watching drop a like thumbs up peace uh hopefully subscribe if you're new or if you haven't yet thank you i'd appreciate it um see you guys in the next video